How to trademark a name. A trademark is a symbol, word, or phrase that represents a product or a service. If someone else tries to use it, you have the right to take legal action to protect it. In order to obtain a trademark, you must come up with a unique mark that isn't already in use, then file an application and pay the filing fee. If your application is approved, you'll be free to use your trademark in commerce. Conducting a trademark search. Determine whether your mark is strong. The first step in the trademark process is to make sure your name, or mark, fits the United States Patent and Trademark Office definition of strong. The mark must have a non-intuitive, secondary meaning that is represents your services or product, and no one else's. The USPTO divides marks into four different categories different strength levels, and those that fall into the weaker categories have very little chance of getting trademarked. Here are the categories, from strongest to weakest. Fanciful and arbitrary. Fanciful or arbitrary marks are the strongest type, because there's a slim chance someone else would independently think them up and start using them. Made-up words and words that aren't usually associated with a certain product or service fall into this category. For example, naming a shoe company Brunix would be fanciful, and naming a beer product flashlight would be arbitrary. Suggestive. A suggestive mark is one that suggests, but doesn't overtly describe, a certain service or product. Marks in this category aren't quite as strong as those considered fanciful or arbitrary, but you can still get a suggestive mark trademarked if it meets other requirements. Using soft and bright as the slogan for an undershirt company would be suggestive. Descriptive. This category of marks is considered weak, there's a good chance other people could independently use the same mark, which would make the trademark protection difficult to enforce. Calling a cleaning service wash and scrub cleaners would be descriptive. Generic. It is not possible to trademark a word that falls into this category. Generic marks are in widespread, common use, and it would be impossible to enforce a trademark protection. Naming a lantern company lantern is an example. Generate search terms. Once you've come up with a strong mark, it's time to make sure it isn't already in use. If another company has already trademarked your company name, you will be unable to trademark the name yourself. Start by thinking up some search terms. Since your goal in performing this search is to determine whether another company is using the name that you want to trademark or anything very similar, you will want to choose search terms that match your company name exactly and those that are very similar to your company's name. Perform a basic trademark search online. Begin the search by typing your search terms into an online search engine such as google.com. Note the results of each of your search terms, taking special note of those results that are very similar or identical to your company name. Note the type of product or service that any similar marks are used to represent. Any mark that is very similar to your company name that also represents a similar product or service to your company should be noted. For example, if your company is engaged in the business of making and selling hairspray, look in the search results for the mark being used in connection with hair care products. Perform a basic trademark electronic search system search. Consider hiring a trademark attorney. After conducting your search, you should have a good idea of whether another company has already trademarked your company name or something very close to it. You may also see applications of others that have already been denied for various reasons. If you find that another company has a mark similar or identical to yours but you still wish to proceed with using your company name, you should consult a trademark attorney in order to determine if you are legally entitled to do so. If you find no other company using your name as their own mark, you may still want to hire a trademark attorney to ensure that your search was accurate. An attorney will also help you complete the complicated filing process.